Okay, I just wanted to provide a bit of an update as to where things had gotten with the coding tool over the weekend. Um, some minor user interface and navigational uh, changes. Um, here we have the home screen when the user is not logged in. Um, so you can see here just a message is displayed saying log in to get started. So we can click log in and we'll get our Google login handler. Once we're logged in, we'll auto direct to the games view, which will list all the games that we've got that are coded. Um, from here, we can send an email uh, of the coding uh, to ourselves. We can view a report from that game based on the coded statistics, uh, or we can delete it. So in this case, we'll just click delete and confirm that that's what we want to do. And now we just we can either click into code or this helpful message here, which just says click to get started. But we'll go up to here. Um, so now from here we can click start to get started coding. And again, we see the timer kick off. We can start coding various codes and see that from the history they appear. Um, they now display with the most recent ones at top and I'll only show the most the 15 most recently coded items uh, we can delete items from the list uh, and then re-add further ones and as you can see they appear at the top of the list um, down the bottom we're still getting the XML um, I'll probably hide that at some stage or at least provide another button that allows you to hide it by default and display it um, conditionally I can't imagine that you would want to see this while you were live coding. Um, but from here we can click stop and give our game a name. So we'll call it BBB and submit it. So once that saves, it now adds it to our list of games um, and would have by default emailed us a list of the codes. Um, and the bit that I haven't implemented yet is reporting. Um, which as you can see when you click it, it says not yet implemented. But the idea will be that you would get a basic report showing um, you know, basic stats about 25 entry, you know, if it's a hockey report, 25 entries, goals, etc. Maybe 25 momentum, entry momentum. Um, but you would also get, when you kick off a game, you would get a link, uh, so if we go to code, when you click start, I'm envisaging having a shareable link here that would that you could give to the to an iPad um, and have the iPad on the bench and be able to view those reports live uh, from the bench. So um, that's where the uh, game's at. As you can see, all your games will be stored here until you delete them. You can view reports across those or resend coded games. Again, if you've got any uh, feedback, that would be terrific, uh, but I'll leave it here for now. Thank you.